Ahoy hoy, and welcome to the video. I'm Dr. Sumerian, not a real doctor, and today we are going to go over the dank memes from the dank memes from site 19 subreddit. And in case you missed my announcements yesterday, uh, we are going to move to uh, Wednesdays only for uh, today, obviously, and then all of July, and we'll get back to two videos a week in August. But there is a site-wide contest of which I would like to devote all of my, to er, not all, obviously, but uh, an outsized amount of my attention to, and in order to do that, I need to cut back on uh, uh, video making uh, in the meantime. Plus, with any luck, it means that I can create uh, higher quality stuff on the days that actual videos come out. We will see how this works out. Uh, but right now, the, the uh, plan is to continue making two videos a week every week uh, starting uh, in August again. Either way, let's get into the memes. SCP's titled something like Flowers for the Hidden House. I sleep. SCP titled something like Bernie Sanders stole the Atlantean presidential election. I really do uh, enjoy these uh, sorts of things because I do this too. I mean... The wilder your title, the more likely it is somebody's going to click on it. That's just how it is. An SCP community, a uh, basic bitch sort of uh, <laughs> basic bitch titles are very unlikely to get you uh, the kind of attention that you need. That's just uh, the way it is. It's unfortunate, but it is uh, it, it it is what it is. Things that cannot be SCP-055. Kirby. A Master Ball, H2O, Your Mom. Ugh. Accurate. Accurate. I'm not going to explain that one. You can figure that one out on yourself. A God, an omnipotent being, an apex tier pluripotent potent entity. Um, yeah, I will say, um, on the one hand, clinical tone does make a lot of things clearer than it would be elsewise. But then sometimes you get stuff like an apex tier pluripotent entity, where, I mean, the authors definitely had a lot of fun creating the terminology that they're using. I'm not saying this specifically, but, you know, in general. But it's actually less descriptive than you would get out of simpler language. And the other half of this is that there's there's some value to this because an apex tier pluripotent entity would indicate that there are multiple tiers of pluripotent <laughs> entities. Uh, it's the same as the original SCP-173 implying that there are, you know, uh, there's a 174 and a 172 and so on. Uh, but yeah, no, this, uh, I, I do, I, yeah, definitely a, definitely a problem sometimes. And, and sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not. SCP authors, when their articles include fairies, and they have to think of a bunch of unique nicknames for the forest where the nameless reside. I mean, or you could just not. I, I really, I really dislike that. Yeah, that that's that somehow become the way that the the fairy uh, as the fairies have to be dealt with on the SCP wiki. I mean, it doesn't have to be. I think there are some articles that ignore uh, ignore taboo. Uh, as a canon piece of the wiki, but yeah, no, this, this, I disagree with this wholeheartedly. SCP fans, when they find out about the predators of the animal kingdom that are just boring monsters that kill you. I mean, the idea of, this is absolutely true. It's the reason why, like, you know, a bear isn't a story. And that's the thing. An SCP article needs to be a story. I mean, even if, even if you think that SCP-173 is just a thing that kills you, there's some there's information being imparted. There's a implication for it. But if you just tell me about a bear, I know about bears, <laughs> you know, <laughs> and with a lot of uh, uh, killing monsters that just kill, I mean, like you're not giving me anything new. Uh, but if you create, you know, the the town that got effed by bears, then you have a whole, you have something that's actually interesting and can hold audience, uh, yeah, audience attention. Okay, kid, listen. I don't have much time. The way to get people to read more tales on the SCP wiki is... No. No, it's just... It's just milk chocolate. Made of gorilla. You know, the thing about... Uh, tales in the SCP wiki is that... Like... I feel... That people approach it from the wrong direction. They think to themselves that they've got to come up with something really cool. Um, 
and long and quality, but like the average writer on the SCP wiki, no offense, uh, is not really good enough to keep a reader's attention for that long. So what they should be doing is focusing in on uh, flash fiction stories. I mean, my average for tales is definitely lower than my average for SCPs, but my average for tales is uh, 80 something, right? Which is pretty high. I mean, if someone gets an 80 something on any tale, uh, that's that's a that's actually pr really really good. And uh, having an average of 80 something when we're talking about uh, 65, 66 tales um, is, is you know it's 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 a so maybe my experience is different than the average experience, or maybe what I'm telling you. <laughs> It's like maybe 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 what I'm telling you means nothing because my experience is invalid because I have an atypical experience with tales. Or maybe what I'm telling you is useful information on how you could possibly get more eyes on your stuff. Make it shorter. Make it better. <laughs> make it better is not really advice so much as just you know uh, general life advice, I guess. But it's not good writing advice. But make it shorter. Make it better. Make the title pop like we were just had the meme earlier where we were talking about this make it something that the incentivizes people to be like wait what's this about and so on or you can just keep doing what it is you're doing and complaining that no the nobody reads tales i mean it, that's that's what and that is what most scp not 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 naming names but most scp authors just keep doing exactly what they're doing without trying to really find a way to fix themselves and instead say that the system is messed up and and that's a problem you know you want to be more discovered more often do the things that you need to be discovered more often is all i'm saying uh let's go over credits for the memes the first meme was by dead for december the second meme was by just someone random the third meme was by leah cube and the fourth, fifth, and sixth memes were by shoulder. Uh, <laughs> uh, thank you very much for your uh, memes. They were quite entertaining this week. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit the subscribe button and then hit the notification bell next to that so you're notified when I upload new videos. And then head on over to patreon.com forward slash dcimmerian and pledge at any level like everybody here on the screen already has, including Sinjariki, who has pledged at $100. It is nice to know that I am not alone out here. And I will see you all again on next Wednesday. I almost said Thursday. Next Wednesday.